Full disclosure, I keep seeing sellers use the terms Pearl and Mother of Pearl interchangeably as if they're the same thing. They're not. I thought I'd make this video in order to give you a more comprehensive understanding of the difference between the two, because most importantly, there's a big difference in price. Pearls are formed inside the soft tissue of certain species of mollusks, such as oysters or mussels. When a foreign object, such as a grain of sand or perhaps a piece of shell, gets stuck inside the mollusk's shell, the animal secretes a substance known as nacre around the object to protect itself. Over time, layer upon layer of nacre builds up, forming a pearl. Pearls come in a variety of shapes, sizes and colours, and can be natural or cultured. Natural pearls are rare and expensive, while cultured pearls are more common and less expensive. Mother of pearl, on the other hand, is the iridescent layer of material that forms the inner shell of certain mollusks, such as abalone, oysters and mussels. This layer is composed of the same substance as pearls, nacre, but in a different form. Unlike pearls, mother of pearl is not formed as a result of an irritant inside the mollusk's body, but rather as a protective layer on the inside of the shell. Mother of pearl has a beautiful shimmering effect and can come in a variety of colours, ranging from white and silver to pink, blue and even green. Of course, in terms of value, pearls are generally more valuable than mother of pearl, especially natural pearls. However, high quality mother of pearl can still be quite valuable, especially when used in jewellery or decorative objects. Of course, both mother of pearl and pearl have been used for centuries in jewellery and decorative objects. Pearls are often used in necklaces, earrings, bracelets and rings and are considered a classic and timeless choice. Mother of pearl, on the other hand, is often used in inlays, buttons and watch dials, as well as in jewellery occasionally. Mother of pearl is also commonly used as a material for guitar picks due to its durability and unique sound. In summary, while pearl and mother of pearl do share some similarities, such as their composition and beauty for example, they are in fact two distinct materials with different origins as well as appearances. Understanding the difference between the two can help you appreciate their unique qualities and make informed decisions. In my experience, on the occasion when I have seen sellers mislabeling, it does appear to be an extension of ignorance rather than deceit, so it's probably a good idea to take that into account.